hello there. What's a little human doing so deep in the jungle? I haven't seen one of you in quite a long time. You're not a hunter, are you? No, an explorer then, off to chart new places. You seem to have mapped the interior of this ditch quite well. You should probably be more careful wandering through the wilderness, you know. Sweet things like you tend to attract predators. I'm joking, dear. I'm not in the business of hurting sentient creatures. Violence leaves a bad taste in the mouth. Now, may I... Oh, easy there. There's no need to panic. I'm not going to hurt you. Hey, hey, easy. You're going to pass out if you keep hyperventilating like that. Alright, I'm really quite sorry about this. But I don't want you hurting yourself. So, I'm going to need you to just relax. That's it. Just relax. Stare into my eyes and let everything else fade away. The fear, the panic, just let it go. You're safe. You can lose yourself in my eyes and just sink. Good girl, isn't that much better? There's no need to be afraid. I swear, I am not going to hurt you. Just breathe for a moment and let yourself calm down. There you are. All right. In a moment, I'm going to release my hold over you. When I do, you're going to stay calm. All right? I'd like to help you out of this trap, but I can't do that if you're going to panic the moment I get close. Do you understand? Good. Now. Up you get. Wake up, little one. Are you alright? What was that? Oh. You really aren't from around here, are you? Why, all of my kind can use hypnosis. It makes cornering prey much less dangerous. I apologize for using it on you without your permission, but I was afraid you'd hurt yourself thrashing around. Oh, it's perfectly alright. I understand I look fairly imposing. I meant it when I told you that you are safe. I want to help you out of here, if you'll allow me. May I come closer? Thank you. Goodness, you really are stuck. It might take me a while to cut through all of this, but I'll have it done eventually. Just hold still a moment. Not that you have another choice, but, you know, here we are, hold still, little one. Oh, there's no need to thank me, this is sort of my fault anyways. I built this trap, I constructed a few of them to catch animals, spend less time on hunting, you know. I didn't think a human would ever make it this deep into my territory. If you don't mind sharing, what are you doing here? A map maker. So my earlier guess was correct. You are an explorer. That's a brave venture. Especially for something as defenseless as you. Oh no, I didn't mean it like that. You humans just lack any sort of natural weaponry. 
No fangs, no claws, no inborn magic. I think you're actually quite an impressive species, considering all of that. You use wits and tools to accomplish what you want, and you do it all with a certain level of courage. Or maybe foolishness. I never have been able to tell. Yes, I've met humans before. They're not usually as kind to me as you are. I think my, well, appearance tends to frighten them. That's why I spend most of my time alone. Anyways, that should be all of it. Let me help you up. Feel alright? No injuries? Good. I don't mean to be presumptuous, but do you have a destination you are moving towards? This place has no small number of nocturnal predators, and the sun is about to set. Oh, yes, being stuck in a place for hours would disrupt your travel plans. I suppose that is my fault. Well, you are free to do as you will. But, if you need a safe place to stay the night, my home isn't far. Of course I don't mind. I don't get visitors very often, but I always enjoy having them. It brings a little excitement to my small corner of the world. Excellent. Here, I'll show you the way. Here we are. Humble, I know. But it should be comfortable enough for one night. I'm not sure if what I eat is suitable for you, but I can at least offer you my bed. Of course you can. You're my guest. I would never want to be an ungracious host. Well, if you are sure, I suppose there is room enough for both of us. I haven't been calling you little one for nothing. <laughs> Very well. Sorry, you'll have to speak up. What is it? Oh, hypnotizing you. I really am sorry about that. I didn't think. Oh, you enjoyed it. No. You don't need to be embarrassed. It wouldn't be very effective if it wasn't pleasant, would it? I don't want to put words in your mouth, but is it safe to assume you're bringing this up? Because you'd like me to do it again? No, it would be no trouble at all. Just a few words and I can relieve your stress and send you gently off to sleep. It's good practice for me anyways. As long as you're sure. Very well. Come. Sit. Make yourself comfortable. I'll go slowly. This time. Now. Take a deep breath for me. In. And now. That's it, little one. Just like that. Keep breathing. Nice and slow. You're safe here. I'm going to help you relax. Now, why don't you look into my eyes? Oh, you're adorable, little one. Yes, look into my eyes and sink for me. Stare and sink deeper and deeper. The more you look, the harder it is to look away. But you don't want to look away, do you? <laughs> no. Why would you? When it feels so good. All you want is to let me take you deeper. 
deeper. Good girl. Every word I say brings you just a little farther down. Down and down and down. Into a nice, comfortable trance. Yes, that's it. You can just lose yourself in my eyes, in my voice, in that wonderful feeling. All you have to do is stare and sink deeper and deeper. You look cold, little one. Here, let me help. I'll just wrap you up, keep you safe and warm in my coils. There we are. Isn't that nice? And if you're good, maybe I'll give you a little squeeze. <laughs> I'm only teasing. It feels good though, doesn't it? So nice and comfortable. So safe, so calming. Oh, are you having trouble keeping your eyes open? That's all right. You can close them. Just close your eyes and sink even deeper for me. Good girl. Can you hear me? Good. You're doing a wonderful job, you know. And you can just enjoy it. Any stress, any worries, just let them melt away. They'll be there in the morning. But right now, all you need is rest. You can rest, little one. I'll keep you safe. Just drift. Just sleep. That's it. Let everything else fade away. It's just you. And me now. It feels good, doesn't it? To feel safe. To let all your thoughts go. You don't need to think right now. All you need to do. Is listen. You know, if I'm being honest, I'm sort of glad you fell into my trap. I never would have gotten to meet you otherwise. Now, I can hold you tight and make you feel so good and guide you into a deep, deep sleep. Yes, sleep for me. Little one, drift into deep, dreamless sleep. Shh, I'm here. You're safe. You can just 